And so what I'm going to do is actually just read this question out and we'll kind of solve it together. And uh, you'll kind of see how I'm thinking about the question, how I'm talking it out and uh, how I resolve errors, et cetera. So I'm going to go ahead and just read it through. I'll kind of pause at the, the end of each paragraph to explain what I'm thinking and what I got from the previous paragraph. So Amazon customer reviews. Amazon is building a way to help customers search reviews quicker by providing real-time suggestions to search terms when the customer starts typing. When we're given a minimum of two characters into the search field, the system will suggest at most three keywords from the review word repository. As the customer continues to type in the review search bar, the relevant keyword suggestions will update automatically. Okay, so I can imagine the user interface here. I'm searching for um, a specific customer review. There's a bunch of customer reviews in uh, some sort of repository and I'm kind of searching between them. And it sounds like we're doing an autocomplete, a simplified autocomplete here. Uh, so it says, write an algorithm that will output a maximum of three keyword suggestions after each character is typed by the customer in the search field. Okay, so we want a maximum of three keyword suggestions. It's probably important. Um, if there are more than three acceptable keywords, return the keywords that are first in alphabetical order. Only return keyword suggestions after the customer has entered two characters. Keyword suggestions must start with the characters already typed. Both the repository and the customer query should be compared in a case insensitive way. So there's a bunch of requirements in there. Um, we need to do alphabetical order. Uh, we need to do case insensitive, and we need to wait until two characters have been typed. Um, okay, sounds good. So then next down here, we've got input and output. The input to the method slash function consists of two arguments. Repository, which is a list of unique strings representing the various keywords from the Amazon review comment section. Then we've got customer query, which is a string representing the full search query of the customer. Okay, so we can actually see that over here. Um, we've got repository right here that I just highlighted, and we've got customer query that I've highlighted here. Couldn't see both of those things. Um, makes sense. The output is a list of a list. Okay, that's a little confusing that we have a list of a list. Uh, return a list of a list of strings in lowercase. Okay, so they have to be in lowercase, where each list represents the keyword suggestions made by the system as the customer types each character of the customer query. Okay, I'm starting to get this, I think. Assume the customer types characters in order without deleting or removing any characters. If an output is not possible, return an empty array. Okay, so I think the list of the list really means that every time the customer types a single character, we would be then getting a list. And then the list of a list is uh, each list for each character that they typed. Uh, but a really good way to find this out is to look at the example. So the input of the example, we've got um, a repository consisting of mobile, mouse, money pot, monitor, and mouse pad. And then the customer query is mouse. So then the output here is mobile, money pot, monitor on the first list, and then three lists in a row with mouse and mouse pad. And then they've got an explanation here. So let's read that. The chain of words that will generate in the search box will be M-O, M-O-U, M-O-U-S, M-O-U-S-E. OK, so that makes sense to me because every time the customer is going to type an additional character, we're going to see um, one more part of this word until they eventually get to mouse. We can also see that there's four results here. So that makes a lot of sense. Um, each line from the output says, shows the suggestion from each one of these. So we can see that Mo is mobile, money pot, monitor. Those all start with M-O. And then once you add that U in, that eliminates all of those words. And we've just got mouse and mouse pad for the rest of these. OK. And then they these are all alphabetically ordered. We can also, one other thing that I kind of notice is that the input is not ordered for repository. So we've got mobile, mouse, money pot, monitor. Those are definitely not in order.